Hello, this is going to be a short tutorial on how to use Earthenview 64 uh, for watermarking a large number of photographs at once. Uh, to get started, you're going to need Earthenview 64. You're going to need, you know, some photos to watermark. You're going to need a watermark. And you're also going to need to make an output folder uh, for where to save the watermarked photos at the end of this process. You have to do that first. Uh, I'll show you why once we go in there. So um, we're going to go into, pardon my OCD, eh, there we go. Uh, we're going to go into Earthen View, go to File, Batch Conversion slash Rename. And in here, we can do all kinds of really cool things, but we're only concerned with the one thing. Um, go ahead and change output format to PNG. Go ahead and make sure this box is checked. Use advanced options, and then click advanced. If this box isn't checked, you can't press this button. So make sure it's checked and press advanced. Now in here, the only thing we're concerned about is add watermark image. There you go. And then we need to go to settings. And then from here, this is where we choose the picture we want to use as a watermark. Um, so if you look in here, I've already made a watermark. It says watermark. We need this to add on top of the photos we want to add it to. That's uh, me on an Alaska trip a couple years ago. Lovely place. I recommend it in the summer. Um, so we're going to go to choose. And then in my case here, it's going to be different for you, but just navigate to where you saved them. Desktop, watermarks, watermark. Bottom right is fine for me. Uh, I don't know what it defaults to, but pick where you want it to be. Uh, whatever number this is, as long as it's between 25 and 40 percent, you shouldn't have any problems. Uh, I think mine, I think it defaults to 33 percent, and I just left it. So and it, it works great. So there we go. And then from here, that's all we need here. So we go ahead and hit OK. And so we've picked our output format, we've picked our watermark. Now we need to pick the photos to put the watermark on. Uh, so again, in my case, desktop photos, uh, yours will be different. Maybe, maybe not. And I'm going to just press add all. You can double click them or, you know, click highlight, add, uh, however you want. They'll, it'll list them down here. And these are the photos that are going, or pictures rather, that are going to be getting the watermark added to them. Now for our last step, we need to tell Earthen View, oh, hard to say, where to save the new watermarked pictures. Um, so we go into browse and in here you can't add a photo, at least not that I know of, there's no add, or sorry, add a folder so that's why it's important to have your output folder ready to go beforehand. Um, there might be a keyboard shortcut to do it, but I don't know it. So I pick my output folder, and then I just hit Start Batch. And then we can see it's done six files, no errors, no warnings, and then we hit Exit Batch. And as you can see here, we've got some pictures in our output folder. And there we go got watermark, 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 and watermark. So I hope you found this useful and uh, thanks for watching.